Good morning, people. Watch from in 65, Lisa Boyce. I'm going to give you the gospel. It's in 1 Corinthians 15, 1 through 4. Christ spilled his blood for our past, present, and future sins, was buried, and rose again on the third day, according to Scripture. We're saved by grace through faith in Christ alone, not of ourselves, not of works, least any man should boast. It is grace that God gave his only begotten Son that whosoever believe in him will not perish but have eternal life. Once you come to the end of yourself and admit that you're a sinner in need of a Savior and there's only one and that's Jesus Christ, and you accept Christ as Savior, the Holy Spirit will indwell in you. The Holy Spirit will lead you. The Holy Spirit will guide you. The Holy Spirit is your best friend. The Holy Spirit will change you. Not only are you saved and rapture ready, but you are sealed until the day of redemption, which means you will not lose your salvation. I'm coming on early this morning. Um, my husband, Kevin, has to have a procedure done with his heart so uh, they're going to put a catheter through his vein in his arm and they're going to go in his heart to take a picture to see if there's a blockage there so I'm um, coming on for that I could use your prayers for that I'm sure he'll be okay but still um, <clears throat> this article it came out yesterday um, is preparing, the White House is preparing for potential shutdown as leaders grapple with cru uh, crucial deadlines. Now, I don't know what's going to happen. I'm going to be watching this throughout the day. I'm definitely going to come back on with another video later um, about this because I'm sure other articles will be out uh, later about this. Uh, in the meantime, I'm going to post on my blog. I don't know how long I'm going to be at the hospital. Um, it'll probably be most of the morning and part of the afternoon. So that's why I'm coming on this early. Um, let me see. Nobody else has anything out, and I think it's because it's too early yet. Um, yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Shelves across the nation are empty. It's looking like it's going back to what it was post-COVID. People are buying. Costco's shelves are empty. We went to get some containers to clean up here yesterday at Walmart. Shelves are empty. So this is it's starting again. Um, I do feel, I do feel that something is about to happen, and I'm praying that it's the rapture of the church. But like I said, I will be back later. Uh, I'm going to be gone most of the morning, so I will be back later on to give you more. In the meantime, um, I just thought I'd come on here and let you know. Thank you.